there's a game over here on Kickstarter that I thought we should take a look at called Littlewood, a peaceful RPG by Sean Young, who's done a few games in the past. For this one, he wanted $1,500. He already has 33000 with still 15 days to go, so clearly something is special about this game. Uh, it kind of has a uh, bit of an Animal Crossing kind of a feel, right? The whole story here, we, we have saved the world. We went out, we were an adventurer, we saved the day, we killed a big boss, and now we've come home. And now it's time for us to build a house, be happy, uh, settle into this little village, hopefully get people to come join us. We can do various jobs for them. We can do crafting and fishing and collect various things. Um, all in this, you know, animal style, Stardew Valley kind of a kind of a setting and kind of a feel. All the different jobs we can do, Tarot Master being one of them, uh, merchanting. Um, there's various folks, of course, in town as well. And all the stretch goals is also. There's a demo here, so we're going to see what's so special about the game. There is no mouse needed here. It's all keyboard. I'm assuming controller will come before too long. Um, but we're going to jump into a new game and create ourselves um, a person. So we can go with... Oh, you know what I just saw there? Yeah, we're going to go with fuzz. And we're going to go with... Yeah, the brown was good. Um, that's good. That's good. Um, ivory is good. Yeah, yeah. Outfit. We'll go with um, overalls. No, no, we went wizard. Yes. Personality. I'm not sure how personality, what that does for us. Curious, kind, naughty, creative, friendly, pirate, or bookworm. Well, we're going to go pirate. Okay, so Bob decided to, uh, he just came back from adventuring. He beat the devil out of the nearest easel, and now he has decided to settle down and live with the happy squirrels or whatever that are in the world. So here we are. We're now in our little house. We can come wandering outside. And say hello to the nearest the nearest citizen. The only citizen in town right now is Willow. Bob, you're awake! I was so worried about you. You were asleep for three days. All the towns across Solemn are finally beginning to rebuild. What? You don't remember anything? Come on, don't be silly. You, the hero of Solemn, saved the world by defeating the Dark Wizard? You really can't remember? Huh? That means you probably don't remember the... Ah, never mind. We'll get you back to normal soon. Well, first things first, we've got to rebuild this town. Okay, let's do that. Hello, Willow. So we can talk to her, we can compliment her if we want. Hey, I don't know who you are, but uh, your hair is not... No way my hair is not pretty today. You're so nice, Bob. I, he's a nice guy. Let's chat with Willow. I don't know what this town's name was. How about we give it a new name? Sure. What do you think, Bob? Uh, well, we won't call it Littlewood because the kids will just make fun of it. Let's call it something... Spectacular. Like, um... Like, uh... Yes. Nookstone. Excellent. That's a fine name. That settles it. This town will be called Nookstone. Hey, is that Dalton over there? He got my letter. Now we're, we'll have more help with rebuilding Nookstone. Oh, and I almost forgot. Here's a blueprint for a house. You should try building one. Okay, now we know how to make a house. So, this is the big part of the game. Let's go do it. Uh, first off, I'm going to pick up some stuff out of this chest. We got some 80 wood planks in this one. We got some stone bricks over here. So now this is uh, kind of the uh, the creative part of the game. Let's go decide where we want to build our house. I think we're going to put it... I mean, right over here is fine. This uh, this spot here. So we're going to build mode. We can we have items in our pocket. Uh, we have a build mode where we can go. We can we can adjust the land if we wish. Maybe we, want, uh, maybe we want this to be risen a bit more. We're using some of our green grass we have. We'll move this tree out of the way over here. Pop something like that out. A nice and square spot. Um, you know, maybe we, um, you know, we're, we're a hero, right? Maybe we should live on a, like a bit of a elevated place. That's what heroes live on. Let's do something like that. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Um, that's not what I want to do. Um, let's go back to build mode and put in our, uh, our ground so we can have some stairs up here. Something like that should be good. Um, we'll do double, double. Um, and then let's see if I have it big, big enough here. We... Trees and crops, we don't have any of that yet. We have only my house and the fence. Pop my house down. Oh, it's not big enough. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Not big enough. One second. Okay, almost there, almost there. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm keeping the wrong button. Build mode, and uh, let's rem destroy those, those, and then go put in a... There we go, okay. Now we got it. Now we got it. Okay, my house is going to go here. I'm spending, of course, some those logs and stone bricks that I got, but we're going to put it around right there. Okay, so there's my house. It's here. Let's go inside. And there it is. Hey, Willow. Come on in, Willow. 
This house is perfect for a, a great hero like you. But it is a little empty. You should start by building a bed. Okay. Plung, one plain bed. Well, let's build a, build a bed then. Nothing else I can really do here. I can move, but nothing I can change in here at the moment. There's no wallpapers or anything at the yet either, but they'll be there, I guess. We'll put our bed right, um, right here in the middle. Okay. Um, decorative, nothing here yet either. Okay, there we go. What do you say, Willow? Some extra building materials are right by my house. I know, I already picked them up. Feel free to help yourself to them. All right. Um, anything else? Tomorrow, I'm going to explore our nookstone some more. If we had some tools, we could start chopping trees. Uh, yeah, that would be great. Uh, let's go see. I think she said Dalton was here. Let's go talk with Dalton down here. Yeah, there he is. All right. Hey, buddy. Well, so the rumors are true. It's really you. Bob, our savior from the Dark Wizard, is alive after all. What? You don't recognize me? But we did so many quests together. Maybe the Dark Wizard's magic wiped away your memory. Well, in any case, this is a cause for celebration. I've decided I'm moving into town right away. I'll help you re regain your memory, Bob. Hopefully, you can remember all the funny jokes I told you on our past adventures. All right, now we have to make Dalton's house. Dalton wants a house. So what we could do is the same things we just did before. We can go into build mode. We can throw his house down. Uh, we got Dalton's house now. He can go wherever we want to. We're building a town up here. I mean, we can, if we don't like Dalton, we can stash him away back here in the corner. We can put him uh, up on the uh, up here. We can put him, I don't know. Let's just stick him. Dalton, where do you want to live? How about if I stash you back over this way? I mean, stash. Stash is a hard word. Let's just let's just place you over here. Uh, I'll even give you I'll I'll even give you a, a little road. We can go something like yeah, like that. There you go, buddy. Okay. Let's go say hello to, to Dalton's house. Yeah, looks like a house. Where's that Dalton at? There he is. Hey, buddy, I built you a house. No time. You should come visit me tomorrow, after I settle in my new house. I have a really neat idea for this town. Okay, I will will do. Uh, now we can go pluck things out of the ground here. It, we don't have a pickaxe or an axe yet, so we can't go and do that. We've got, what is this? Oh, this is the calendar. Okay, yeah, so we've got things going on. This is spring, of course. We have a mysterious visitor on the 14th of the month. We've got Farmer's Day. We've got Willow's Special Gift Day. Uh, what is that? Is that a log? I think it is. Yeah, we need an axe for that. Okay. Um, well, I think we should just venture on home. Notice how this works. Is Actually, you know what? Willow, I can give her a bed, I think. Can I give her a bed? Yeah, yeah. Willow's sleeping here without a bed. There you go, Willow. Oh, uh, you just get one. Okay. So let's go back into our house. I guess well, Dalton doesn't have a bed, but he doesn't need one. Let's go over here. And head on in. Will, are you still here? Tomorrow's going to explore. I'm with, yeah. Uh, now, I can't hang out with her yet. That's not in the uh, demo, but we can go ahead and go to bed. Yeah, let's sleep. At the end of the night, we can see what all happened. We got a little bit of skill in gathering and lots of willow talking. Welcome to Tuesday. All right. Let's go see what we can do here. We got mail. And there's an old man right there. Hey there, Bob. I'm so glad to be working with a hero of Solemn. I think Nookstone is going to be the best town ever. Thanks, Willow, for the cash. Hey there, Bob. I hope you're getting accustomed to your new home here in Nookstone. Now that you're here, we can start thinking big. I think our next step for this town is to start earning some dew drops. Over, uh, all over Solemn, there are many travelers and merchants looking for neat things to buy. We need to build a marketplace. Okay, let's put a marketplace down. I will do that. Uh, anything else you have to say? You can place items for sale in the marketplace. The next day, those items will be turned into dew drops. All right. Who are you, Dudley? Bob, is that really you? My goodness, how much you've grown. Willow sent me a letter saying that you survived the fight with the Dark Wizard. I was so worried about you on your adventures. You don't remember much. That's okay, Bob. What matters is the world is safe now because of you. Maybe this old man can lend a hand with rebuilding this town. Okay, Dudley wants a house. Okay, Dudley, I'll get you a house. Um, don't you worry, buddy. I'll put your house in right over... Uh, right, about right there. There you go. Alright, what do you say? I remember the day you first set off on your adventure. My goodness, what an exciting day that was. Anything else you have to say? Nope. What if I go inside? Let's go, uh, we'll talk to with, uh, what's his face also in a minute. Oh, Dudley's coming in. 
Thanks for building a house for me, Bob. It's perfect. I think I'll make many good memories here. Speaking of memories, do you remember how I uh, how to fish? Hmm, so it looks like I'll have to teach you all over again. All right, we got a fishing pole now. And then these games are not complete without learning how to fish. Fishing requires a lot of patience. Be sure to cast your line next to a fish, not on top of it. Then you have to wait for the bite before reeling it in. Okay, I got it. I got it. Um, let's go get one. There's a fish right there. Let's toss it right next to it. Wink. And... Yoink! Yeah, fish! Okay, okay, okay. Well, look at this guy. Oop, that wasn't very good. That wasn't very good. Can I throw it out further? I can't. Um, I can't get those guys then. Hmm, alright. Let's go chat with... So if I want to build this, uh, if I remember right, this marketplace, it's pretty massive. Yeah, so if we want to put this marketplace out, we say we want to put it down, like, here. We have to remove these rocks and sticks and... Well, they call them trees, but... Oh, we put it there in the middle of the road. That seems strange. Isn't that strange? Oh, you know what I can do? I just rearranged the whole land. Oh, we can do this. Um, I'm going to move. Let's put it... Uh, I like the idea of having it over here where the fence is. Let's just move these rocks around. Get that one out of the way. Toss it up there. We'll get this tree out of the way. Man, I understand why I'm the hero now. Just move things wherever I want. Can I move the bugs? Yeah. We can even move the bugs. Okay, you go over there. Uh, whoops. Go over there. Okay, I like that. I hope I didn't ruin things with that little spot there. I may have. There we go. Okay, uh, now we want to put in this thing. Marketplace. Yeah, perfect. Okay, done. So I can put things on here? I can put on um, some weeds. Weeds. Pesky plant keeps popping up all over town. Yeah, I'll put some weeds on there. What else do you want? Um, anything else over here? Bugs and fish. Sure. Okay, let's go talk with Dalton over here. So these two towns were here. Are This is the wood mill, the lumber mill. So I can take logs and turn them into planks. Uh, and up, up north here, there is a blacksmith. I can turn rocks. Or, well, blacksmith. A little bit of everything. I can turn rocks into um, stones. And I guess I can turn iron into things as well. I guess. Uh, let's go see what Dalton has to say. Hey, buddy. What you doing? You sad you don't have a bed? Let me get you a bed, buddy. Look kind of sad in here. I'll toss it over here in the corner. All right. What's going on, buddy? Hey, Bob. This is a cozy house that you've built me. Thanks a lot. Now, us heroes finally get a chance to relax. So, I had this really cool idea for Nick Stone. But when I woke up, I forgot it. I guess I'll just tell you all the funny jokes I've heard since we last met. Okay, okay, okay. You ready? Two ogres walk into a shop. One says to the other, Hey, you think they serve human here? Guess what? The other one says. Wait, I just remember my idea for Nookstone. This town needs a shop. It would probably attract a lot of travelers. Each new person could heal, uh, could help you regain your memory, too. Oh, a general store. Yeah, I'll make that. Is that what you work at? Are you the uh, general store guy? Oh, gosh darn it. I forgot the uh, second half of that joke. Maybe the dark wizard got to my memory, too. Oh, boy. Okay, so we need a general store. Um, let's put the general store... Let's kind of keep things... Like right here in the middle of town, or maybe I go over here. Pop this thing out of here. Stick it right in here. How big is it? General store. Yeah, yeah, this is perfect. Just stash it like right there. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Is that you, Dalton? This shop is perfect. Oh, yeah, I stocked some neat tools. You can have them if you like. Oh, yeah? Those gloves will be useful for picking fruit and planting crops. That axe can be used to chop up wood debris around town. And that pickaxe will break any stone or ores around here. Okay. I'll, sure, I'll take it. You're going to give it to me. I'm, I'll clear you out, buddy. All right, anything else? Now that my shop is open, I'll have to stock up with interesting items every day. Yeah, I'll come back and take them also. This is a limited demo, so that probably won't be happening. Thanks again for your help. I'm sure this will attract new travelers in Nookstone. Sure, yeah. Yeah, let's go ahead and get out of here. Okay, we got items now. So we can just go around, and I think we can just... Just... Yeah, just automatically uses it. I'm just using Enter for everything. Enter and Control, my two buttons. I don't have a bug net yet. We can pick that out of there just fine. Um, we can chop a tree down, I guess. 
Yeah. Um, do you have something to say? You can place items for sale in the marketplace. Yeah, yeah. Next day, I'll return it. Okay. Um, let me compliment you. No oh, way, my hair is not pretty today. You're so nice, Bob. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like your hair, I guess. Um, okay. Well, let's go grab a few more things. Um, I guess what we can do is we can take these logs. And we can go... Is it getting dark? It's getting dark. We can go over here, though. If we need to. And we can turn these logs into planks. Yeah. There we go. Alright. Um, well, let's go to bed, I guess. I wonder if there's anything at the bottom of this well. And I don't know if there's any sort of combat or anything in the game. I don't think so. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Yeah, let's go to sleep. See how we did today. We did lots of things today. Okay. Wednesday. We've got mail. Alright. Uh, thanks, Bob. Uh, thanks again for building me this cool shop. Uh, just so you know, I restock my new items, new items every Monday. And one slime apple. Um, oh, my market worked. Okay, we got... Uh, oh, people just leave the coins there. There we go. 20, 30. Oh, that's a lot of money. I got 120 bucks now. With the marketplace, new travelers and merchants will appear to buy your items every day. I recommend selling any weeds and meteorites that you find laying around. Actually sell for quite a lot of dewdrops. Yeah. Apparently so. Uh, hey, Dudley. Remember the first time we fished together? That wizard really did a number on you. We were very young then. And for me, I, I was in my prime. We went out on my old boat on Lake Okiwoki and fished all day. I had to cover you up with cold towels because of your sunburns. We still had a lot of fun out on the water, though. And now, because of you, folks everywhere can have days like that again. Well, I am a bit of a hero, I guess. Um, okay, what else do we have to make here? Uh, let me show... I guess there's more things to show. I got the journal button I haven't shown off yet. So we have met... We can see who we've met. We got level 6 with uh, Willow. Level 2 with the other two. Uh, we have hobbies in town. We can see gathering, mining, wood cutting. There's bug catching, uh, farming, cooking, merchanting, tarot master, and gathering. Um, and we have all the things that we've done, which is nothing. Apparently we can make uh, museum items, uh, town wishes. Um, let's see what else we can do here. Nope, nothing in here. He's not even here. Um, where's the old doll in that? There he is. Hey, buddy. Hey, Bob. I know, I know. My face looks terrible. This morning, I was trying to get some weeds around my house, and a big dragon wasp stung me right in the eye. In the face. I'm going to craft a bug net, and I'll catch every last one of those bugs. Can I have one? Give me some time to craft that bug net. My face hurts too much right now to move. All right. Um, well, in the interest of, of seeing more gameplay, we're going to go to bed, I think. Because I did... I played through this a little bit, obviously. And... I think someone exciting shows up tomorrow. So, let's go... Um, oh, you know, what you, could, you know what we could do? You know what we could do? Something very important. As, uh, as leader of this town, it's very important that we keep the riffraff out. Something like that. Kind of goes like that one. And we'll see if we can fit it in there. Let's go pick that thing up. Yeah, yeah. Get that weed out of here. Okay. Uh, now let's go build. Can I even nature? No. We can put in wood fence, though. I only have eight of these things. There we go. You know, just just a little bit. Just a... You know, a bit of a... I'm, I'm stuck. Uh, <laughs> okay. Don't stand there. <laughs> okay. Okay, bad idea. All right, let's just go in and go to bed real quick and uh, we'll wait for the next day. Because I think someone pops in here in the next day that we can talk with. Thursday. Day four. All right, let's see what's going on. Anything else exciting over here? Oh, yeah, here we go. Here we go. Green guy. Hey, green guy. Hey, Bubsy. Hello there. I'm Bubsy, an inspiring chef who wants to create the best food in all of Solemn. Word travels fast, and I hear our hero is building a town. I just had to come see it myself. Nookstone is really looking amazing. But there's not much to eat here. I'm sure my signature slime pudding or my bubbly dragon drink would satisfy the townsfolk. So what do you say? How about we work together to make some delicious recipes? Okay, Bubsy wants to live somewhere. We can get Bubsy a house. Uh, let's go do that. Let's see what Willow has to say real quick. 
You know, Dalton made a good point this morning. He says you need an, an official title and your own office. What do you think your title should be, Bob? Well, I think my name... Mayor? No, 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 no. Um, I think you may call me... Um, I think all, I think this, this fits perfectly. It's decided. You're officially Bob Almighty of Nookstone. That has a nice ring to it. I agree, Willow. It certainly does. Now, our official Almighty is deserving an official building. <laughs> it's a, okay. A building where you can write new rules for Nookstone and for the townsfolk. Yeah, I want to make some new rules. Excellent. That's what I was hoping to get to, actually. Uh, I think it needs to go right up here. Because uh, it's a very prominent location for uh, Almighty Bob. Let's go place it here. Let's go get a... Do I have enough stuff for it? That's townsfolk, right? That's for the bird guy. I need... I have enough? Yeah, I do have enough for this. So let's just toss it right there. Oh, I'm short. I am short on wood. I need ten. I only have three. Okay. So let's go get some wood planks real quick. Shouldn't take too much time here. We'll go get some logs chopped up. And uh, is that like a mud puddle back there? I think it is. Clear this out a little bit. That should be good uh, enough. We need ten of those things. I can probably, I guess, I guess I can't buy them. General store doesn't have anything until Monday. So let's run down here to the old dinners. Look at all the fish. Oops, I put it on the fish. Got that guy though. Ooh, a trout. Okay, let's sell it. I don't think there's an, a hunger mechanic in here. So we'll toss the old fish on there. It's an uncommon fish, apparently. Uh, oh, you got anything to say, buddy? I forgot to tell you something yesterday. While you were out adventuring, this old man found his green thumb. I grew all types of veggies on my old farm. It was quite rewarding. In case you wanted to try growing some crops, I wanted to give you this. Oh, thanks. You gave me some dirt. First, place some tilled soil down, then you place some crops on top. Make sure you don't place anything one space above or below the crops, or else they won't grow. All right. Thanks, buddy. Let's go in here. Let's go make some wood real quick. I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. So I think as I work, I think things... Yeah, as I work, time progresses. It's not really like a, on a set... I think it kind of is on a set schedule, but I think it's mostly as you work, it speeds along, I believe. So poor Bubsy had to sleep outside last night. We were busy. Um, apparently, we slept right here. <laughs> okay. Um, hey, buddy. Sorry about the uh, inconvenience there. Only worth 10. Just wanted to say thank you for letting me stay in your town. Well, I mean, people here are so nice. Willow and Dalton gave me some food requests this morning. I think we need to get cooking right away. Oh, there's a tavern. Yeah, let's do it. Um, sorry about the <laughs> lack of a house, buddy. Uh, let's put the tavern... Well, we got behind things to make here. Uh, I want to get my most important to get my mayor's office done. It's going up here. We're going to put it right there. Yes. Now, the tavern takes 10 also. Um, what do you need for this? You need 10 also. I need all this wood. I don't have any wood. Um, all right. We'll have to go get some... Have to go do some... some Chopping things up. Now, in here, I don't... We'll see if I can do anything up here. Anything in here? Oh, exclude for the demo. Oh. All right. So, I guess we got to go and get Dalton his house. And, uh... And his, uh, his tavern. Travel quite a bit since you defeated the Dark Wizard. Many towns are rebuilding and people are rejoicing that we finally have peace again. We do one last thing before we... Have, we're going to have to call it a day here, so... Let me pop down... Some... Tilled soil. I have 20 of these. Let's just do like that. That's fine. Now, can I put in... Yeah, crops. I mean, I got six of these. Oh, perfect. There we go. Okay. Perfect. Alright. Thanks again for watching. We're going to call it a day here. But I will see you next time. This is on Kickstarter. I'll put a link below. You can check the thing out. And I will see you next time.